Alright guys, this is DocM with another Minecraft video and today, as many of you guys requested, I want to show you a way to do a hidden trapdoor setup like this. Closes off and you can walk over it, you have a clean floor, for sure you can uh, use any other block you want. I just used the clean stone here to make it visible nicely. As you can see, um, what you can see down there is some of the redstone wiring, um, but yeah, anything else is pretty nicely hidden and you can use it as a drop to get wherever you want. It looks like this from below and now I'm gonna have a closer look and check out how we're gonna build one of those things. JL um, who you can find in my box, he got some really really good redstone stuff going on on his channel and for sure Minecraft Addict both contributed to that uh, trapdoor design here. JL also has a, a nice tutorial how to set up a trapdoor. Um, his setup is yeah, as compact as mine. Um, the only advantage um, I have with my setup here is that it uses um, not as many resources, namely you don't need that many repeaters, you only need four instead of eight which uh, he shows in his tutorial. But I guess he uses slightly less redstone so yeah, give or take, uh, it's an alternative design and next step is we're gonna attempt to build one. Okay guys, so now as we had a look at the inner workings of the thing, let's build one. It's pretty simple. Just put six sticky pistons like so and on top you can put your block you want to shove up and close your uh, trapdoor with. On the opposite side do exactly the same. Make sure to leave a too wide gap here in between. This is where your channel is gonna go. Now what you can do, you can close off the top so you can imagine better where your channel and everything will go. You drop a too wide trapdoor setup here. Do it like so if you want. Use anything, use any material for sure. Alright, so now the basic setup is done. Now it's time for the wiring and don't worry guys, it's pretty simple. Just place two blocks here and do the same thing on the opposite side. When you're done with that, it's time to hook up some repeaters. Place them facing outward and put them to the first setting. Do that on all four positions here. Like so. And the last one right here. Next step, block on the four corners. Last step for the basic wiring, throw some redstone dust on the four corners. Just as simple as that. Now it's time to wire the thing together. If you put a redstone down like this, one side is already functioning. If you test it, and there we go. The blocks go out and up. So, last step would be to connect both sides to work together. One way, maybe you can come up with some more nifty wiring, but I think it's a good way, is just simply do a trench around the outside corner here. Also, don't forget your redstone on here. Do have some more. So, some more redstone, make sure to connect both sides, like so. Uh, it's even better if you go down here, like so. It's important for the placement of the lever later on. There we go. And now, um, yeah, we're done guys. The thing is working, it's functioning. Let's test it. Boom. Trap door up, trap door down. 
let me quickly turn to daylight. Last step, you know, there's um, a way you can have your levers on top as I did. If you want to do that, make sure to place them on the on top of where the redstone line goes out here and you know tries to merge with the other side. If you go the other way around, you, your lever goes there. If you have it like me, your lever goes there. If you don't do it like that, it won't reach and the door won't fully close. I will demonstrate that. See? So you then you would need an additional repeater and the setup would become more complicated. So this is a compromise you have to do. Same goes for the other side. Place it, if you want it there, on top of the redstone junction there. So, see, works from here as well. So this is my way of building the setup. Thanks a lot to Minecraft Addict for showing his, this cool up and out design. And for sure GL, he has his tutorial out as well, as I mentioned. Um, that's it for today. Have fun creating your own trapdoors. Funny stuff can happen with that. Just think about the possibilities on SMP servers if you want to lure some people somewhere and basically, yeah, switch your lever somewhere hidden and oops, down they go. Woo! <laughs> All right, that's it for today. I'm out. Bye bye.